Hi everyone! Today's going to be my March favorites and it's going to be a quick one too. I'm going to start off with these blushes that work amazing on oily skin. I'm talking about the Balms in Stain blushes. These are just amazing. Like they say, they do actually stain your cheeks. Like The color just lasts hours and hours like by the end of the day I still have color on my cheeks and when you have oily skin you know that blushes don't tend to last that long which sucks but these ones just work so beautifully on oily skin every single time the bombs on Outlook you'll find these and they'll have them for like around 50% off the retail price so these are amazing and I have two shades I have this one which is a bright coral shade called Toile and then I also have this one which is the newest addition to my collection, to my mini collection and it's called Houndstooth so it is a nice kind of mauvey pink blush. It's the one I'm wearing today as you can see. <laughs> I know these are kind of expensive, but if you follow me on Facebook or Twitter, I always let my followers know when the Balm, Tarte, or Urban Decay go on Outlook so you can check them out and save some money that way. So yeah, just follow me there and I will let you guys know when the Balm is on Outlook once again. Okay, so the weather here in San Diego has been, I don't know, some days are pretty chilly, kind of like fall weather, <laughs> and other days are really hot, and it's just going like back and forth, back and forth. Like today it was raining this morning, and now it's like sunny and warm. Well, kind of on the chilly side, that's why I'm wearing this, but um, yeah, definitely not like 80 degree weather, which is good for me, but um, my skin has just been like, I don't know whether to create more oil or be dry or it's just kind of like confused at the moment <laughs> so I just I don't want anything heavy on my face because of the weather and I've been going back to my bare minerals matte foundation that I bought last summer at Costco <laughs> so it was like probably like six dollars less than at Sephora so that was pretty good so I've been wearing this a lot and I've been applying it with a real techniques buffing brush which I need to get hold on and we're back with the brush. So I've been using this one, which is the buffing brush, to just buff the Bare Minerals foundation all over my face. So I just like swirl, tap, <laughs> and apply like in the commercials. And it's been doing such a great job. Way better than this one, which is the Bare Minerals Handy Buki brush, which just sheds like crazy. <laughs> if you use this, you're, you're going to end up with a bunch of hairs all over your face and your shirt and your sweater and whatever you're wearing it is just one of the worst brushes and mm, they don't have a similar shape but they're both kind of dense if you can see so they apply the product really well but this is synthetic so it's a lot softer and it doesn't shed so if you haven't tried your Real Techniques buffing brush to apply mineral foundation I highly suggest you do because it is a really nice combination. We have a repeat right here and this is the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette. I've been using it so much once again to fill in my eyebrows, to do my eye makeup, to even like contour a little with the, what is it, Naked 2 shade. It is just one of the best palettes I've ever tried. It really is. It's really simple but that's what I like about it, that it's really simple. You can come up with a bunch of eye looks if you want and it's not it's nothing like too obnoxious. So I really like this. I'm definitely gonna be taking this palette to Lucky Fab, which is this week. I'm so excited for that conference. Like I'm so excited to meet other bloggers and Ingrid Miss Glamorazzi is gonna be speaking there and I'm gonna be there watching her speak and that's kind of surreal because I remember watching her when like she was barely starting out on the YouTube like journey and yeah I'm gonna be watching her speak so I'm excited about that <laughs> but back to this <laughs> it is just a great palette it just has amazing shades most of them are matte except Venus which is a highlight shade this next product is a lip balm that I featured in my last haul and if you remember that haul you know I wasn't really impressed by this product in the haul I honestly did not have a really good first impression but you know what sometimes you gotta give products a shot and I did and I've been loving it I really have I've been using this every single night since that haul well 
maybe a few days after the haul, but I've been using it every single night because it is amazing. And I know it, the consistency is still really hard compared to other like lip balms, but I've been using it a lot. I don't know if you can tell. There's like a pretty big dent. And if you don't live in San Diego, I do know that Wild Violetta does have an Etsy store. So if you're looking for any organic or natural products for your face or your hair, I think they also have fragrance. I don't remember, but they do have a lot of like beauty and health products. I will leave their link down below so you can check them out and maybe you can get your own lip balm because it is so, so good. And now it's time to talk about the other favorite that I just mentioned, and that is this lipstick, and this one is by Yves Rocher. I think the name is Prussian Red, but it doesn't say on the bottom. The only thing it says is R312, but I will leave the link down below so you can check it out. And this is the lipstick that I'm wearing on my picture here on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, all of those social media pictures. And this red I like to describe as a tomato red. It just looks kind of like catch up to me. <laughs> I don't know, it just looks very flattering. It's not really like a blue base red, although it's coming off that way in the camera, but it's also not as warm as like Lady Danger or something like that. So I am wearing this lipstick today in combination with the lip balm, so it's a lot sheer than it is on my picture, but this lipstick is just amazing. Let me swatch it for you so you can see it. The color is just great the pigmentation is very strong and it just feels so comfortable on the lips it doesn't like feather out it's just great especially for the price point it is less than ten dollars so it's a very very affordable lipstick if you follow me on twitter instagram or facebook you would know that i went to see saint vincent this month so obviously she's my favorite musician of the month and the concert was so much fun i was in the front i was just like fangirling the whole time singing along and the show is it's just like so theatrical and it's just it's really nice I really liked it and she just plays a guitar like no other like woman in music can play guitar I was just like ah. <laughs> but um it was just such a great concert there was a point that is started getting a little rowdy while she was playing crocodile but um I mean I've been I've been to a bunch of concerts so I know like if there's people behind me like like kicking me and pushing me, I'm gonna push back too, or elbow people. I'm just like, poof, poof, poof. I'm quiet, but I can elbow you if you elbow me. So the day after, my body was just really, really sore. But thankfully, this product landed on my doorstep. <laughs> and this is The Sims Max Freeze. And this is just like icy hot in a bottle. It is just so great. And it's supposed to be for like muscle pain, muscle and joint pain. But if you go to a lot of concerts, music festivals, or actually play sports and you have like sore muscles, you need this in your life. You really, really do. You just spray it. Let me spray a little bit. Spray it on your neck or your back or wherever your body hurts and you wait a little and then you'll feel like so much like warmness and the pain just goes away and you just feel like Oh yeah, I can tackle the world today. I was sent this along with the Sims Crack Cream. I know the name sounds kind of weird, but it is for severely dry, cracked skin, eczema, psoriasis, irritated skin, bug bites. It does a lot of things and it works really great. There's a review on my blog and also a giveaway if you want to check that out. So they just sent me this to try out. They really weren't expecting like a mention or a review or anything, but I was just so blown away by this that I had to mention it in my monthly favorites because I'm going to be using this each time that I go to a music festival, concert, or yeah, that's it. Or exercise, when I do exercise. But <laughs> So that's it for my March favorites. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys next time. I hope you're having a great day or night wherever you are, and yeah, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Bye!